The first official poster for the upcoming film, The Big Short, has hit the web. The film stars Christian Bale, Steve Carell, Brad Pitt, and Ryan Gosling. When four outsiders saw what the big banks, media, and government refused to, the global collapse of the economy, they had an idea, The Big Short. Their bold investment leads them into the dark underbelly of modern banking, where they must question everyone and everything. Schnepp, buy or sell this first poster for The Big Short. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to buy it. It's very... Uh it's enticing. I'm glad it's just not a bunch of actors, giant heads. You know, that's very just fun. their giant names. Yeah, just, well, yeah, they're giant <laughs> names, but it's, it says a lot. You know, it's like, oh, it's you know, everyone's underwater, drowning. There's no money in housing. There's a big scam going on. It says it visually, and yeah. then and then you have those big names where you're like, oh my god, what? They're in it too, and him. You know, it's like it's kind of an all star cast, and I'm I'm looking forward to an adult film that we can actually watch and learn something about how horrible our situation in home marketing and and, and hiding money and all other kinds of amazing but let things. me ask you a question is it too much handsome for one film <laughs> it's a little Gosling, distracting you got pit you got pale and i'll i'll, I'll go right I, th I think steve carell's a handsome man i really do and but here's the, i'm gonna buy the poster for for a couple of reasons number one from an artistic point of view you nailed it artistically this is a this is symbolizes the movie perfectly right. the house is underwater the money floating i think it's beautiful the way it does that now normally i would be complaining about you got four actors' names on there, all whose names are as big or bigger than the title of the film itself. However, I'm going to buy it as a move on their part because when else are we going to see Christian Bale, Steve Carell, Ryan Gosling, Brad Pitt, all in the same freaking movie? Right. That is a giant... Now, normally, you know, the actors, the stars in your movie are no longer... We're no longer living in the age where that is what's going to bring you your box office. But something as novel as these guys in one movie together... I totally get it from a business point of view, but why you do the poster like that, it makes sense. So from an artistic and from a business point of view, I buy it. You know what? There, there's too much handsome. Are we watching <laughs> Magic Mike Double XL? No, I'm kidding. Uh, too much uh, handsome. I'm, I'm going to buy it. And for I'm just looking at the poster right now, and I'm reminded that Adam McKay yeah. co-wrote and directed. That's I'm right. a huge yes. fan of Adam McKay. Yeah. And I'm very excited to see Adam McKay venture into a little bit more serious territory. Yeah. Yeah, maturing in his career. Mm -hmm. He did such a great job. At, like uh, He was part of the rewrite team for Ant-Man, and I love his work with Will Ferrell. So um, just I'm excited to see what McKay does because he he's such a break. I've loved him <laughs> since uh, his work on Saturday Night Live. He's also incredibly political. Like if, You've done some yeah. stuff with McKay yeah, before. Yeah, he's a pal of mine from, yeah. from Chicago. Back He used to be an Upright Citizen Brigade, so yep. he was an original founding member of that. So I go way back with Adam, and I'm, it's always fun to watch friends of yours' careers just you know flourish. Yeah. But he's always had this side which this movie will finally reveal it's like he's got a very serious side he's very he's very concerned Absolutely. about the rest I follow of the him on world Twitter. he's not afraid to mix it up a yeah little bit. he mixes it up so i'm really excited to see especially since he wrote this and is directing it this is going to be a big like mm, and know? i like carell mm. as a serious actor i was a big fan of Foxcatcher. i yes. thought his yeah. performance was good i thought the movie maybe was a little too subtle um i would have loved some like moments that popped that right much but he more. is disturbing as hell in that film yes yeah. he is Freak. yeah no he's, he's shown yeah. he can do comedy obviously with what we know but yeah. he's shown in several films now that he can really carry it yeah, dramatically man. as well. So I'm looking forward to seeing what he does next.